So ladies, let's have a couple of jump floaters surf from this side. Mark's going to use the pocket radar on you. We'd like to get, you know, hey, serve the ball. Hey, if I could really serve the ball hard and in, you know, that's what I want to do. As hard as I can, as low to the net as I can. So these are jump floaters, right? Go. Mark, what do we have as the highest here? 41. My best player jump floater is 48. That's pretty good. Okay, so that's a jump float. Can we get some? Who's a top spinner? This is a jump top spin. So you're going to really toss the ball high in front of you, take an approach, and swing at it. That's what a. See how that ball's spinning forward? That's a key. What was that, Mark? 42? See, so you're going to add a little more velocity to the ball. One of the keys in serving for all of you is to find out how far from the end line is your sweet spot. So is it standing on here, or is it, you know, like when we used to play the Cuban women, the Cuban women served from right there all the time, every serve. And, you know, they keep the ball really low to the net and really hit that ball hard. Hey, but that's the only serve they served. So after a while, you can get used to it. If you could get six different servers, if you at high school have four great servers, you never have to rotate. You know, you just rotate four times and you're going to do well. Yes, yeah, serving is a key. Russ said that. If you can't serve pass, you can't play at any level. One ingredient is how hard you hit the ball, how low to the net you hit the ball because you have less time on that side to really react to the ball. One of the things I think is serving is the skill that we demand the least, per, the lowest performance of in our country. Um, that there are a lot of ways to do it, so you can do it, but at our level, the statistics that I know of is that 90% of the serves go in by us and by our opponents throughout a season. And so players need to understand that, that maybe some people have the leeway of missing more because they serve a lot tougher. But you have to begin to serve tougher and have the errors not go up. It's a constant, 90% in or higher. Um, but most teams do that without pushing the envelope serving. So Terry talked about our short server we had, Carissa Cook. She was an amazing server. Um, short served almost every time. You watch us play next year, we're not going to do that. We are going to raise the level of speed on our servers next year or try. They are all having to get better at it and we're going to try to be what I would call a relentless serving team. We're just going to try to keep coming at you so eventually the speed starts to get to you. Not even as much in areas, more just let's get after it and make the passers be good. So you got to make some choices, but one is the server's technique and the expectations just not high enough, I think, for my team and for everybody else's. I think we're in trouble if, you know, they were, and they, they've never been a great serving team in the Pac-12, but now if he's going to do that, we're really in trouble.